Hey, it's Beth Allen here with a short DIY hacks for home tip to help you organize and keep track of some linens. Getting new linens is always a uh, fun experience, crisp and fresh out of the bag, but you end up with a whole pile of these little baggies. Whether you get a pillow sham or you get a big one from a uh, comforter set, you have to decide, what am I going to do with these things? Do I toss them? Do I recycle them? I say you repurpose them. I have a bunch of these and I've done this for many different uses. Take an old bag, you can take the label, flip it around and write on the label, put it right back in that little slot, what's inside your bag. This is all the travel goodies. You know, there's mini toothpaste and mouthwash and soaps that you collect on a trip that maybe you want to use again or when you run out of something you've got a spare. Toss all of these into a bag, zip it up, put it in the bottom of the closet keeps it all neat and organized. You could put kids toys, you could put blocks, you could put um, cookware, craft items, anything. These bags are great, reuse them. Now another purpose we found for them was when we travel to bring one along to house your dirty clothes. You know, you don't want the dirty socks and underwear getting all mixed in and these are great. They'll hold the smell down but they're really, really great for beach and mountain trips. Maybe you go skiing and you've got all that sopping wet mittens and hats and snow pants. So dump them all in here, keep all the wet stuff together. When you get home, you open the washer, dump it all in for your laundry load. Great for the beach, keep the sandy stuff in here and you can keep everything neat and organized. And they're super sturdy, they've got great handles, love them, don't toss them. Now, what to do with the old linens. Now you've got your new ones, maybe the old ones just got out of style, you didn't really care for them, but they're decent. Well, if they're in good shape, donate them. And even if they're a little worn, threadbare, donate them. Did you know that thrift stores get cash for piles of fabric and textiles? So they can turn the yucky stuff into cash by recycling the loads and pounds of linens. Now another thing you can do with your linens is donate them to a dog shelter. Sheets, towels, blankets, they're thrilled to get that stuff because the dogs go through them. So consider your local dog shelter too. But if you're crafty, you can repurpose those linens and make something new. This is a beautiful um, white mat lasse pillow sham that I never used. Um, I have new linens now, it doesn't really work that well. So I can take this put some decorative trim, tassel fringe or ball fringe, whatever you want, around the edge and this could become a table scarf. You could put it in the center of your dining room table, put your centerpiece. So think outside the box. The other thing, if you're crafty, maybe run the sewing machine, is to take the old sham. This is a beautiful fabric, very French country. Take the sham and cut it right down the middle where it is seamed in the back. And then you can make two smaller pillows, little decorative toss pillows, and you have the fabric, the edges are already done, you only have to cut, stitch one, and put your pillows in, zip it up, use Velcro, whatever you need to do, and you've repurposed. So think outside the box and reuse those bags and give your linens uh, a good home to go to.